106. Great. It's a new record. Last time I got 102. I shifted the light push a little bit more to the front. Ooh. Oh, nasty. I got 103 in a short run, but uh, during the crash all the tape blew off, so the hole was pretty full of water and it's now raining, so I quit it for today. This morning I made a short run with the twin mono. It ran pretty well, but the weather was totally miserable, so I made only maybe two or three sprints. I did get a new speed record, 106 kilometers an hour, so I'm very happy with that. I ran with the cut and sharpened props, 43 mm, 1.6 pitch. I also received these 44 mm 1.9 pitch props and uh, I installed them but I didn't run them. It was pretty clear is that the boat was too loose in the bow. The struts angle has to drop down a bit to plant the nose on the water. I did make two pretty nasty crashes. Luckily there's no damage. I inspected the hull, I inspected the rudder, everything. This is the second day that I'm going to run my twin mono. I zero to GPS. I down trimmed the stinger drives, so let's see if the nose will be a little bit more planted to the water. Cornering is better with a longer rudder. Let's see the speed of the first run. There's quite a lot of water in the hole. 112. Wow, great. Nice. That's definitely a new record. 112. Awesome. Fresh set of light posts. 44. 1.9 pitch props. Let's tape it up and go.
not sure if it's faster than the 43mm props, but it sure is fast. There we go. One hundred and twelve. Wow, it's exactly the same as with the forty-three millimeter props. The GeForce Twin Mono is back in the workshop. Today's run was really successful. I got a new speed record of one hundred and twelve kilometers an hour. The boat ran pretty good. It is stable at high speed, which I really like because I want to get even higher speeds in the future. But there are also some improvement points. I always rewatch the running footage. I rewatch it in slow motion. And it tells me quite a lot about how the boat behaves in different circumstances. And re-watching the footage, I did notice that it seems that these props lift the transom and push down the bow. So the boat was running really wet. So for the next time running these props, I will shift the lipos all the way to the back. Because now I actually push them to the front. I could also hear that the motor RPM with these props is lower. Uh, which makes sense because these are quite aggressive. I do have one issue with the boat because there's quite a lot of water entering into the boat and I think it enters in between the liner and the stuffing tube. I already added some fuel tubing between the stinger drives and the transom but it doesn't seem to fix the problem. So yeah I have to figure out how to resolve that. If you have some advice on how to eliminate water from entering through the stuffing tube into the hull please let me know in the comments. Overall, I think this boat runs pretty efficient, getting 112 km an hour with 1850 kV motors on 6S. is not bad at all. In the future, I will upgrade these to 2250 kV motors, which will get me theoretically a top speed of about 140 km an hour. But let's see. All right, guys, that's it for today. Thank you for watching, and I hope to see you next time. Bye.